Morning. Uh, it's a nice and chilly morning out here and the birds are chirping and it looks like it's going to be a sunny day. So hopefully it'll be a, a nice day, but hope y'all are doing all right and had a good weekend. Uh, I was out traveling preaching, <laughs> but um, I'll tell you about that in just a minute. Uh, and let's start out with a prayer and then we'll hop right into a devotion for today. Let's pray. God, thank you for today. Thank you for all the different ways that you show up in our lives. And thank you for encouraging us and empowering us with your spirit. We ask that your spirit guide us today and every day to go out to work to do your work with you uh, and to let the world know that we love them just as much as you do. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. As I said, I was uh, travel preaching yesterday. I was out, uh, or Sunday, I guess. Every day is different. Um, <laughs> I was at a congregation that helped to support our Lutheran campus ministry. And so I went out and preached and spent, uh, you know, 24 hours with them. And it was nice to uh, put some faces to, to names and, and to see uh, what they've got going on in their congregations and to tell them what we've got going on in our ministry as well. Uh, it's a wonderful part of this ministry is that the connections that we make because of people who support us or people who want to hear about uh, what the students are up to, that kind of thing. Um, yesterday, I also traveled again and I went to Synod Council in Columbia and heard a little bit about what's going on in the Synod, told them about what we're doing again uh, with our stories. Uh, and I wanted to share a little bit about that today because it's easy for us as a congregation to get a little bit exhausted trying to do everything by ourselves, but to know that we are a part of a greater church that is doing all these things um, and that our, our synod support and also just our connection to other congregations in the synod and in the country and all over the world um, help us to feel as if we are doing more of God's work than what we might see with just our own eyes. I tell people all the time, they might not have young adults in their pews on Sunday mornings, uh, but they are doing young adult ministry by supporting what we're doing here at Lutheran Campus Ministry in Clemson, or at Lutheran Campus Ministries all over the state, and in Columbia, and Charleston, and Rock Hill, all over the state. Um, so that's such a special thing for me to be able to tell them, but for us to believe it ourselves too, <laughs> to know that we are a part of a synod that, that supports us, but that we support them, that we are are just as a part of the synod as some of the bigger churches in Columbia and some of the smaller churches out in the country somewhere. Um, it's humbling to know that we are a part of a, a greater network of congregations and of faith communities all over the world. Uh, and it's important for us to continue to realize that. Uh, I think about Paul and was writing letters to the churches that he never even visited, never even met, um, but thanked God for them and thanked God for their ministry and all the different things that they're doing. Uh, and I think that that is a special thing that we forget sometimes. So when I often get bogged down and want to do more and more and more because we can only do so much on a daily basis in Clemson, um, I remember all the things that are happening all over the world in the name of Jesus and in the name of different faith communities uh, and how we might be connected to them as well. Uh, and that is what God calls us to do, not only to be all in and see all and do all, but to, to be a part of this wider church community that is continuing to move towards um, what the kingdom of God should look like. And that's something to remember. So those are my thoughts for this morning, just because I've been traveling all over the place. Uh, I'm back for a while now um, until the end of exams. So uh, I hope you all had a good weekend again. And let's pray and go about our days and see what this week has in store for us. Let us pray. God, thank you for all the different ways that you connect us to one another. Connect us to people in our neighborhoods, connect us to people in our communities, connect us to people all over the country, all over the world. Uh, we remember that as children of God, we are part of something so much greater than just what we see in front of our eyes, uh, but that we are a part of something that you have created for good. So help us to see that. Help us to continue to work for justice and peace and love in this world uh, and to recognize how we are a part of something um, that is working towards your kingdom with you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks, y'all. Have a good day. Uh, God bless.